Welcome back everybody and today we're going to be talking about buying trophies for anybody who's a furniture and to make a lot of gold by just flipping things around and that tree looks kind of bugged. You can, that's a little bit buggy. But uh, yeah, so what I like to do um, and what I always spend my money on is basically looking for trophies and to see what things are selling. So right now uh, there's a guy that wants to sell this. I probably could do, like, I can't do buy orders for that because that's way too expensive. But what you do is that you try to go something a little bit lower, um, something that's kind of like going to be a tier three or something like that. So, example, uh, right now this guy's selling, uh, that's mine right there, selling this for a pretty good price. Uh, making another one probably, we'll have to see. So, making some gold this way. And what I want to do is just kind of find things that are going to be, uh, that has nobody buying anything. You know, and uh, I can see right here there's a quite a few orders. So somebody is trying, might be wanting to liquidate their stuff, right? So I have to double check to see if I can try to buy one of these and just play the patient game, right? So what we do is just to do a buy order and I kind of have to see if anyone is uh, outbidding me and somebody is. So I'm gonna just go and say 60, right? And then um, place one of these for about seven days and see if we get filled right and now i'll be on top and then he put three in so that guy's automatically he can't cancel it if he, unless if he wants to lose all that deposit fee that he does so it's a really good idea just to only do one at a time uh, because if you do like three and i come in and i put place a bit on top i don't really care like <laughs> i mean i want to buy that right so that person's gonna get slapped a little bit but um the thing is once somebody buys my thing it's, he's gonna be next in line right so but i want to be first in line so that's what i want to do so next one i could see like this one i want to see if somebody put a bid order this is uh not my bid order so it depends on how badly you kind of want this right um ideally i don't care too much about this like this guy's really went up high, quite high and there's not much profit to be had sort of per se i mean i could i wish he didn't do it for this price if it was like 800 or something then yeah i'd be more inclined but uh, just for the purpose of this video whoopsies we're just gonna literally go 10, 10 coins ahead of him. And we will do, do uh, probably one and uh, let that go. And we do a buy order for that because I do wanna start crafting some of those uh, furnishing stuff and make sure that you click on furniture buff and click whatever thing you wanna be searching for, right? So that's basically, the I'm buying the tools only because that's what you basically do to, um, to make the trophies. So you can see that one's selling for about 4K could technically buy it um i don't know if i don't think i put a bid order for this but these guys are selling if i'm um, wanting to buy it quite desperately for that price so uh 1500 that's only like only double your profit maybe i, I wish it was a lot lower like anything about below a thousand would be ideal for that type of um mats and stuff like that so um probably won't pick that guy uh, we can check to see how much these guys are going for. Holy cow. Everyone's finding this. So what I'm going to be doing is, um, I don't know, 400. And I want to buy probably two of these. What is this, though? Harvesting is decent. Uh, buy two of those. Somebody's definitely going to want to liquidate. Um... And then I would get two of those and I could flip it for like at least three times the profit if I had to. But obviously I probably would want to craft something with the furniture. And as you can see, I'm burning through my 10K like nothing, which is fine by me. Like I don't really care. Like uh, I need to kind of start buying out some of this stuff. 2K, which is nice. There's only one guy in, in this market. So I would probably do mine for 1K. Put that in there. Let it go. Uh, this is basically a like a very good way of just making money you know well uh well those guys are trying to sell it no one's not going to sell it for that price so eventually they want to liquidate the skinning i have to see how this one's selling for if there's any market oh and there's quite a few people for the for the skinning trophy so probably not likely i probably will we, we'll do one for like 110 uh, that way I'm like ahead of that guy, but they they're gonna definitely sell it to those three guys So not the greatest market, but it is what it is and I uh, kind of have to go through that route and Yeah, that's pretty much all I'm gonna be doing 
and um, picking out what's going to be selling for a bit and then maybe what I might possibly do is that uh, whoopsies I already did two of those so that's completely fine I don't want to go overboard um, this one I might just throw in my order for like I don't know a thousand no 900 uh, I put it for 900 uh, see if I could get filled on that that'd be nice but there's a lot of people that are going to bring down the market very, very quickly. So we have to see what they do. And yeah, that 10,000 is now 800 gold. And you can guys can kind of see why I don't have any money. It's because I'm always reinvesting in everything. And plus, um, in my previous video, I am selling something for ridiculously high price. So I'm selling this for 38k. I'm selling this for 11k. Uh, this for 6k or something like that. So I am selling a few items for quite a bit of value, right? So um, those all cost deposit money. So you're spending at least a thousand dollars just for deposit fees. So I just have to let be patient and let those go and see how well I do for reselling those items. So that'd be really nice if they all sell. Um, if they do all sell, I'll be pretty close to probably 50K and then try to make my way up to like 100K and see how fast I can do it without, you know, really doing that much farming. So um, yeah, I will see what happens, but uh, that's pretty much just like a gist of the area of what I do when I'm maxed out what I'm going to be farming for, what I'm going to be looking out for, what I'm going to be spending my gold for, and basically make that gold back. So it is a bit of a risk, but um, I'll make you uh, make a video of like kind of like my process and see how that works out and basically go from there, right? So I hope you guys like this video. Um, make sure that you guys subscribe because I always post tips and tricks and guide videos. This is a, kind of a more of an interesting guide video and just to kind of see like what, <laughs> like more of a gamble that uh, most people haven't really talked about and see if this actually works. So um, if this does work, I'll be making a lot of money, close to 50K of profit, just pure profit. And uh, yeah, I hope it works. But uh, till then, we'll see what happens. But uh, I hope you guys like this video, like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video.